Good morning, I'm Bad. Today is Friday, November 2nd. I'm Trey Volio. And I'm Tom Parks. And I sure had fun on Halloween. Yes, I enjoyed dressing up on Wednesday and seeing everyone else's costumes. It sure was fun. Did you get any pictures of you in your costume eternity? Sure did. See? That's pretty awesome. Are you going to put those on the Replay It website? Yes, I'm going to put them on there, as well as the pictures from Homecoming and all sorts of others. You know, maybe some people need a reminder of what Replay It is. I agree. Eternity, what are you doing? I'm uh, downloading stuff. Oh, put that away. We got oh. news to do. That's right. Seniors, please stop by room B300 to check to spell your name and your senior photo for the yearbook. You will have until next Wednesday to stop by and make any corrections before the pages are submitted. Baby has to do for this yearbook by December 19th. Ask Hetzel if you have any questions. Also, seniors, your voting ballots for most likely to and best of were due today. Only signed ballots will be counted. The price is about to go up to $75. Yes. Make sure you buy your yearbook before December 1st, before the prices go up. Uh, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm checking my <laughs> Facebook, duh. Oh, um, but you were just yelling at me for having my phone out. It's okay. I'm checking the Arvada <laughs> High School yearbook page for reminders of the important yearbook information. Oh, that's right. Make sure you like them on face Facebook. Speaking of reminders, yesterday night was the opening night for the Diary of Anne Frank, and it will play through tonight and tomorrow as well. The play is going to be an emotional powerhouse, as our actors have been doing an in-depth study of their characters and trying to understand the historical perspective. Ryan Jones has been following their progress. Come see the play detailing the story of Anna Frank, Otto Frank, Edith Frank, Margaret Frank, Hermann von Don, Petronella von Don, Jan Dussel, and Peter von Don, people who lost their lives to bigotry and intolerance. This week, watch the school's play, The Diary of Anna Frank, and experience the story of people who died because of how they were born, who died for their beliefs, and who stayed human in the face of dehumanization. My name is Anna Frank. I am 13 years old. I was born in Germany, the 12th of June, 1929. As my family is Jewish, we emigrated to Holland when Hitler came to power. My father started a business, importing spice and herbs. Things went well for us until 1940, and the war came and the Dutch defeat, followed by the arrival of the Germans. Then, things got very bad for the Jews. In spite of everything, I still believe people are really good at heart. Wow, I'm going in. I'm excited to see our actors do great. Yes, it looks like they have become deeply involved in the story of Anne's life. Mrs. Black's interactive media class did Halloween projects, and they did a vote on who would air today. Let's take a look at those. <laughs>
What was that, that you were saying about basketball during the clip? Boys basketball conditioning camp begins on Monday, November 5th at 5.30 to 7.30. Girls soccer starts tomorrow. I hope, I hope girls remember that they could email soccerdale at comcast.net for more information. Yes, here's some info for pre preseason soccer training. Girls, I'm Alexis Pretho, and today I'm going to be showing you some things to get in shape for your preseason soccer training. And who doesn't love sit-ups? Don't forget to stretch. And after a quick stretch, you have minutes of stairs or any type of running activity. Wow, I really broke a sweat. Enjoy your preseason soccer training, girls. Speaking of sports, do we have any games coming up? Well, there is a varsity football game tonight at 6 p.m. versus Conifer at Trailblazer Stadium which will be streaming live at mycomsumreport.com uh, and a JV football game tomorrow at 10 a.m. versus Conifer up on the Arvada football field. Make sure to go out and support your team, Arvada. Congratulations to Antonio Lopez for liking Beauty and our Crimson Report on Facebook. You have 10 minutes to come down here to B106 and claim your prize. Remember, if you like Crimson Report or Beauty and on Facebook, you can possibly win a prize. That's all we have for you today, Bulldogs. I'm Tyrone Parks. Now I'm Attorney Valio. Oh, don't forget to set your clocks an hour before this Saturday. Daylight saving times ends. Oh, yeah. Don't forget. Have a great day, Arvada. Hey, Arvada, are you looking for a great new game to play this weekend? Well, Assassin's Creed 3 just came out this week on Tuesday. The game takes place in 1775 during the American Revolution. You pursue enemies throughout some of the most famous battlefields, such as the crowded streets of Boston to the snow-covered wilderness of the original colonies. The game designers also added naval warfare, which has never been introduced to any previous Assassin's Creed. So if you have a PlayStation 3 or an Xbox 360, make sure to go down and pick up your copy.